This is question number 13 of miscellaneous exercise of chapter 13 probability. The question is assume that the chances of a patient having a heart attack is 40%. Okay. It is also assumed that meditation and yoga course reduces the risk of heart attack by 30% and prescription of a certain drug reduces its chances by 25%. At a time, a patient can choose one of the two options with equal probability. It is given that after going through one of the two options, the patient selected at random suffers a heart attack. Find the probability that the patient fo uh, followed a course of meditation and yoga. So the question is like this, that uh, there is a 40% chance of uh, a heart attack and uh, it is also said that if you are going to take a yoga course, the the risk of an heart attack is reduced by 30% and taking certain drug reduces the risk of heart attack by 25%. And uh, the patient can choose only one of the two options. Okay. Now, after going through one of the two options, which the patient was suggested, the patient suffered a heart attack. So we have to find the probability that the patient followed a course of meditation and yoga given that he suffered a heart attack. Okay. Now to solve this question, first of all, even be the event of following a meditation and a yoga course. Okay. And you to be the event of following the prescription of certain drugs. Okay. And A be the event that the patient suffers a heart attack. Okay, the, 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 there are equal probabilities that either of them can be selected. So probability of E1, that is probability of following a yoga course would be 1 by 2 and probability of using a prescription of a certain drug would also be equal to 1 by 2. And in this case, we require probability of E1 given A. Okay, now E1 given A would mean that the probability of following a meditation and yoga course given that the patient suffers a heart attack. Okay. And uh, probability of E1 given A by using Bayes theorem can be written as probability of E1 into probability of A given E1 upon probability of E1 into probability of A given E1 plus probability of E2 into probability of A given E2. Now to calculate the probability of E1 given A, we, we require probability of A given E1 and probability of A given E2 and probability of E1 and E2 has already been D been calculated. So probability of A given E1 is the probability that the patient suffers a heart attack given that he fo follows a yoga course would be equal to 1 minus 30 upon 100 that would be equal to 70 upon 100. So because uh, by using the yoga course the risk of a heart attack is reduced by 30% so this means that there are 70% chances of suffering a heart attack. Okay. 1 minus 30 upon 100 that that would be 70 percent or 70 upon 100 uh, 100 is the uh, chances of suffering a heart attack and similarly probability of a given e2 that the patient uh, suffers an heart attack given that he followed a prescribed drug would be equal to 1 minus 25 upon 100 because the drug reduces the chance of an heart attack by 25 percent so 1 minus 25 upon 100 that is equal to 75 upon 100 so now we have calculated all the things which we have uh, required so we have to just place the values so this would be equal to probability of even into probability of a given even would be equal to 1 by 2 into 70 upon 100 whole upon 1 by 2 into 70 upon 100 plus 1 by 2 into 75 upon 100 and this would be equal to this 2 by 100 2 by 100 2 by 100 are going to cancel out so this will be equal to 70 upon 70 plus 75 70 plus 75 is 145 and this would be equal to 14 upon 29 which is the required answer so this is how i'm going to solve this question Friends, thanks for watching my video. To watch more of these super videos and for the latest updates, subscribe and like the videos on these channels on YouTube HSK Shiksha and Math Help by HSK. Thank you.